I hope it's complete. Only one way to find out. Let's hammer that sucker out. And check out the detail on this one. Gosh, I hope it's complete. Oh, it's still going. It's still going. I just found something absolutely amazing. And it's not that. And so far, this is what it's looking like. It's just like a J. I found a fossil that's the shape of a J. Look at the detail. Gosh, this thing is still going. And there's a little ammonite right there. I am back at Ammonite Creek. It's summertime. The water level is low. We've had rainfall over the spring, so that helped wash out new fossils. If you'd like to see me out here more often, leave a thumbs up. Let's get this video up to 1,000 likes, and I'll give away several ammonites that I find to several lucky subscribers that leaves a comment. And right off the start, we have an ammonite. Check this one out, guys. Let me know if you can see it. Yep. Right there. It's a small one. Detail on both sides. Yes. Compared to what I usually find out here, this is really small. And I bet they get even smaller. Heading over to the good spot. Looks like there could be one right here in all of this mud. So this looks like an ammonite right there. Let's work on this one and see if it's going to be complete. And we have help with RD1 today. It won't take long to get this one out. This is more of a really soft mud material versus this stuff down here so this one's coming out really easy oh yeah it's ready to lift up already oh my gosh look at that it's an ammonite it's cracked Looks like we have a lot of mud to get off of that Oh my gosh look at that check that one out it's got a hairline crack right there I've got to be extra careful but this one can split right in half that is a museum piece quality right there look at the detail hopefully I'll be able to display several of these fossils that I'm finding at the Dallas Museum because they are lacking big time in ammonite displays. They have like two or three ammonites to show off and they're not even that pretty. Nothing like this, nothing of this size even. That is amazing. Thank you RD1 for helping get this out so easy. This is awesome. It's gonna be a fun day. I would like to find several museum pieces. That way I can have a display at the Dallas, Texas Nature and Science, Science and Nature Museum, however it's called. I was there last week and they had hardly any ammonite. We can do better than that, I believe. We could have my own display in some museums showing off amazing fossils that I find here in Texas. Working my way towards the water. And look at this one right here. It's just sitting up. I believe it's gonna be attached in the... Oh no, it's not. It's a... <laughs> and it's complete. Another complete ammonite. Got some mud on there. Probably just leave that one there. Something tells me I'm gonna find my biggest ammonite today. Well, this one here is new. It wasn't here my last trip about a month ago. You can see how it's still, like I was just showing you, it's uh, washing out and all this has washed out, leaving this ammonite. You know, it's still stuck in there. It's got a hairline crack. Almost all of these ammonites that I find are cracked. So when you see me handling them and they crack, it's not my fault. It was already cracked before I started messing with it. Yeah, we'll go get RD1 for that one.
And right over here, while I was walking to go get the drill, I spotted this. That could be massive. That's big. I hope it's complete. Only one way to find out. That's hammer that sucker out. Man, look at this one. It's broken. Oh, man, it's huge, too. Oh, see, it's broke. It's cracked. But, wow, that's a nice one. To me, this is one that died, and then it was covered in the mud and fossilized. But it's like it was already dead, and there's things growing on it, and it's like, you know, ate out and stuff. Oh, look at this one. <laughs> there's an ammonite under there. Wow, that might be worth getting. Wow, we're finding ammonites left and right that will require the hammer drill, RD1, to remove. This is so much fun. I probably walked over several. Heading towards those ammonites we just found right here on the way. We have an ammonite. And check out the detail on this one. Gosh, I hope it's complete. It's in that nice material that's really soft. Oh, it's still going. It's still going. Uh, it's got a nice little, it's got a little circle to it. Oh yeah, this seems to be complete. Hmm. little chewed up but you know what the other side may be perfect you don't know until you get it removed okay time for some rd1 Well, been at it for a while. It's not really a complete ammonite. Most of it's in this really hard concrete. All right, that seemed to have broke it free. Oh my gosh, look at that. Too bad that it's broken. I could always cut this and it'll make a nice bookshelf or just a piece that will sit up beautiful detail all right let's go get those others working my way to the end of the hot spot looks like we have an ammonite right here and it's cracked kind of a bummer let's walk on down here the very end there might be something waiting for us you never know it's a tight squeeze through here you don't want to go off in that nasty water very nasty it's texas oil pumps overflowing all their crap into our waters tons of pollution and trash yeah i wouldn't uh, recommend swimming in these waters there's always a dead cow upstream it seems like and no telling how many others oh my god look right here so i worked my way to the end i'm going to step out onto this hopefully it don't break off into the water but yeah that's the end and right here looks like we have a ammonite look at that oh my gosh it's got some mud on it but it's definitely a complete ammonite just sitting here waiting for someone to pick it up 
All right, I'm glad I came down to the very end. That's as far as I want to go. Let's go back to these other ammonites that we found in the mud and get them removed. Getting warm. About time to get out of here. It's been triple heat in Texas for almost a month now, and it's just now July. We have been cooking all of June and some of May. Yep, we need to come back and get this one. And I also noticed a couple smaller ammonites right over here. And here's a couple smaller ammonites I noticed. That one out there looks a little rough, but this one's been covered up and it may be a complete ammonite. Work on that one as well. We've got tons of surface hunting to do yet. All of that. I could even walk up that channel. And of course the other spot way, way up across the water. Get this video up to 500 likes within five days of being uploaded and one of you that subscribes and leaves a comment will win this awesome ammonite and you can practice for yourself removing this mud if you want or you can just leave it the way it is but yeah let's get this video up to 500 likes within five days i just found something absolutely amazing and it's not that check this out this is like an ammonite but it's making like a hook shape we've got to get this out of here this is so cool look at the detail so it's some type of fossil i'm not sure what it is i'm not a fossil person i'm a diamond miner but dang man this is awesome you know, I was at the museum, and I saw one of these on display, and it's like that long. I think I have it beat with this one here. It's not like I'm trying to beat anything. It's just, uh, it's always good to have something bigger and better, huh? 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 came off of it oh man right there is that one there oh this is so cool I've never seen anything like this out here and so far this is what it's looking like it's just like a J I found a fossil it's the shape of a J. It's an ammonite formation. It's got the little spikes, you know, and somewhat. This is awesome. This is a very rare creature. We don't see these every day. Yeah, unfortunately that piece broke off, but you know, a little super glue right there. That's what a, museums are great about doing is putting broken fossils back together. All right, well, that's where we're at. Something's biting me, so I need to hurry up and get this out of here. We may have to come back for these other ammonites another trip. That Texas sun is just beating down on me. Ooh, this is so cool. We've got some type of new fossil that I've never seen out here, and it's almost removed. Let's check it out. Oh my God, it's still going. Oh my god, a, holy crap, guys. This thing is still going, and there's a little ammonite right there. But this thing is still going. And I wish I could be a little more careful and more patience and more time, but I'm sorry, I just can't. Oh my gosh, look at this thing. It's, all the, it's right there. That's the end of it. Man, I wish I'd have taken my time on this. A little super glue won't hurt but there's an ammonite right underneath this this is so cool 
I'm gonna get the fossil book out, figure out what this is. This is insane. All right, I'm gonna keep going. Kind of mad at myself for getting carried away, but you know, live and learn. That's all we can do. That's all we can do is learn from our mistakes. Man, what is this? Right there, I found a new type of fossil. Let's check it out. Insane. Makes a J shape. It's like an ammonite that's been stretched out. Insane. All right, there it is, removed out of the mud. Looks like it's just, uh, could be a complete. See, it wraps in and starts to turn. That may be a piece of one. Maybe a piece missing. But you can see right there, you got detail on both sides. Still trapped in the mud. That can be prepped out with a air chisel. Time to get out of here. Got the wagon loaded. Amazing day, all I can say, finding this. And there's the other piece and the other piece. That's a really cool fossil. We'll get it super glued back together. You won't even know it's broken. These ammonites are absolutely amazing. I say I had a pretty good day. Here's everything that I found today. Several complete ammonites and this new type of ammonite. Incredible. That's almost three foot long. And we have a small ammonite embedded in the mud right at the end of this amazing new fossil that i found today of course these ammonites are absolutely amazing museum quality and here is the ammonite that will go to one lucky subscriber let's get this video up to 500 likes in five days of being uploaded all right that's gonna wrap it up here at ammonite creek Thank you all so much for watching. I can't believe what all we found today. New discovery, new type of fossil. It's gonna be amazing to get cleaned up and prepped. Thank you all so much for watching. Until next time, take care everybody. And here is the, looks like we have something right here. A small ammonite. It has some mud attached to it, yep. It's like it's just broken up we'll leave that one here lots of fish over here look at those fish Twenty or thirty over there. <laughs>